Hi, my name is Kostya, and for the last 20 years, I've been a professional magician, traveling around the world, performing at private and corporate events, using nothing but an ordinary pack of playing cards and pure sleight of hand. Right now, I'm about to teach you some tips, tricks, techniques, things that I've created over my career that you can add to your repertoire, using nothing but the cards and the very box they came in. So I hope you enjoy. Let's begin by looking at solitary confinement in action. Now this is not a camera trick, it's really one of those live action tricks because when you see it, the misdirection works really well to fool you into watching closely. The box is on the table, they've examined it, we show that the cards are all different, we riffle down for them to say stop and they see the card and they remember the first card is the king of hearts. Second person says stop, they remember the queen of diamonds. So now you have two cards in two different places and you give it one cut and hopefully that brings one card to the top their first card, the King of Hearts. For the second card, you say you'll do it a little fancier. You go to the box and you go, can you hear it shaking inside? Look inside the box, that's the King of Hearts because right down here is that Queen of Diamonds. And that is solitary confinement in action. Got it? So two cards, two different places. If I give it one cut, you get one card to jump right to the top. That's Damn. your card, right? Damn. That's the Queen of Spades. <laughs> okay. Watch the second one, right? The second one will go even faster. It's going to go inside the box. Do you feel it? Go. Look, you actually hear it shaking inside the box. What? Look, right no, here. No, look, look, look. That's the ace of spades. Wait, that's your card in the box. Your card in his hands. Oh my oh. god. <laughs> that was your card? Yeah. Wow. So look, inside here, that's the, oh, that's the queen of spades again. Your card, the, uh, the five. Oh! oh. <laughs> <It is. laughs> yes. Now let's check out Shulian Reloaded in action. This is a quick little piece you can throw into your repertoire anytime you need. And for this I recommend having a little box with little tabs torn off. Now the box starts out here on the table and they can shuffle up the cards all they like and then they're going to reach in and they're going to take one out. So you have a spectator take a card, let's say the, uh, the five of clubs there, and you can lose it in the deck, give them a nice little mix, whatever you like. Now what you do is you riffle at the box and that causes the magic to happen. They can actually hear it shaking inside there's their card, the five of clubs. Now you can have them cut the cards in half, and you can take the five, place it into the center, they square up the cards all the way, and anytime you want, you can make that card reappear back inside the box. And that is Shulian Reloaded. That's what I love about these tricks. They're not big performance pieces, but they're parts of the jazz magic that I love to do for people. So they keep it fun for me, and they make me work hard because I believe that strong magic can often be built on strong side of hand. So I wish you luck, I hope you enjoy practicing and performing this material. Thanks so much, take care.